So you say there ought to be a law, huh? Well, I say there ought to be a law against people like you. Greetings once again, everybody. Hell's Unicorn here, and I'm just giving everybody a heads up. This has actually been making the rounds uh, throughout YouTube that Ron Paul's 2008 campaign channel has just been taken down by YouTube for terms and use violations pertaining to copyright usage due to some complaints by certain unnamed third parties. Now, while most of the other people that have been bringing this to light have been talking about all of the various means of how to correct this issue, I wish to take this brief little moment just to reflect upon how something like this is actually possible. Everybody is aware, or at least should be aware, that we have something in this country called fair use laws, which states that if something is being used for educational purposes, for use in parody or satire, and I think there's a couple of other uh, specific uses that are covered under this, you are allowed to use copyrighted material. Now, it's pretty clear from the channel description that used to be up on ronpaul.com 2008 that they were using this news footage for educational purposes and such copyright infringement does not apply. Nevertheless, this, just like all other things pertaining to government, doesn't really matter much when you have enforcement bodies that wish to do whatever they want. And with the vast number of laws that we have on the books right now, it's pretty difficult to argue against them doing what they're doing because somewhere there's a law that states that they can do it, even though there might be two or three other laws contradicting that law. The only reason why we have so many laws on the books that nobody can know them all at one time is for selective enforcement purposes. And that is precisely what this is, selective enforcement. So the next time somebody says to you there ought to be a law, regardless of what the subject may be, if it's not something that pertains specifically to life, liberty, and property, that person has just confessed himself to be your mortal enemy, even if they don't know it yet. So fight the good fight, try to get this channel back up, but regardless to whether we succeed, just take a lesson from this. Every time a new law is passed, some law-abiding citizen somewhere has just been made into a criminal for no other reason than that the government doesn't like them. Take from it what you will. With prudence to myself and benevolence to all of you, good evening.